it's just so hard to even fathom all of this because it's not even real to me right now. I, I don't have any feelings right now. I don't even know how to, I don't know anything right now. All I know is my son Tyree is not here with me anymore. He will never walk through that door again. He will never come in and say, hello parents, because that's what he would do. He would come in and say, hello parents. All my son was trying to do was get home. Yeah. That's all he tried to do was come home. He was two minutes from the house when they stopped him. He was less than 80 yards away when they murdered him. Hmm. Yes, I said murder. That's right. Because when I walked in my because when I walked into that hospital room, my son was already dead. The the hospitals, they kept him alive or they put him on the breathing machine just for my satisfaction, I guess. For their satisfaction. But my son died on January 7th. The doctors pulled the plug, pulled the plug on January 10th. You know, last Monday was Martin Luther King yeah. because at the end of the day, my son and no son deserves this at all.